In this video, I'm going to show you a step-by-step -step guide to using Help Scout, a popular customer support platform. So if you're new to Help Scout, this tutorial will walk you through the key features, setup process, and how to manage support tickets effectively. So by the end of this video, you'll be ready to streamline your customer service operations and improve your response times. So let's dive in. But first, what is Help Scout? Help Scout is a cloud-based customer service tool designed to provide businesses with a simple yet effective way to manage customer conversations. Unlike traditional ticketing systems, Help Scout provides a shared inbox and knowledge base that feels more like email, making interactions more personal and collaborative. So the key features of Help Scout is it has a shared inbox, it has a knowledge base docs, automations and workflows, and collision detection. So now let's move on our Help Scout dashboard. So when you just created an account, you will now be redirected to your dashboard. So as you can see right here in our dashboard, you will have this setup guide right here. So first thing you want to do is first create an inbox. So you'll want to set up your inbox. So from here, you need to connect your email or connect your social media accounts. For now, I'm just going to skip this step. Uh, for this video only. So just do this first. And next, you want to import your data. So import your past conversations into Help Scout. So this is the best way to explore your new account is with your own data. Start a free sample import. So just click here on Start Sample Import. And as you can see, you need to import your data into Help Scout. So you can either choose your Gmail either use Salesforce or other platforms. So for now, I'm just going to skip this step. So next is you want to set up Beacon. So ready to create your first Beacon. So adding a Beacon to your website is the best way to connect with customers instantly. So this is like a customer support, just like this. So when you click here on this chat icon in the lower right, this is what the beacon looks like. So it's like a AI that is talking to you if you have questions and it can automate answers and redirect you to your answers. So to set up beacon, just click here on set up beacon. So you want to customize your beacon name right here. So let's say help AI. You can also select the icon. So this icon is the icon right here in the lower right. Let's leave it as it is right here and click on next. And now talk with customers. Uh, you can uh, set this. Chat is enabled. Email form is also enabled. So connected inbox. Of course, you want to select your connected inbox. So this is what I named it. So it's help right here. So you can also show photos so you can choose up to five photos to display on the contact form click on next and now you need to install places code on your websites so if you don't know how to do this simply copy it first and click here on send instructions now you want to send email and this will be emailed to you so now just follow that instructions and let's go back Next is create a docs collection. So you need to create a knowledge base with docs. I'll just click here. Now I'm just going to name it test. Now you can now open test or customize your website. So let's just open it. So we don't have any article yet. So you need to click here on create article. Again, test. You can also import a file if you want. And now from here, you can now edit it. So it's just like Microsoft Word or Docs. So you can simply add uh, information right here. 
So when you're done, just click on publish in the top right and you're good to go. Now let's go back. Next is connect apps. Of course, you can connect a bunch of different apps to uh, Help Scout, such as Slack, uh, HubSpot, Shopify. You can also browse apps if you like. So they have a bunch of different apps right here, such as Capsule, Google Workspace. So this is the most recommended one. So if you connect your Google Workspace, you can see all of your files right here. Yeah, let's go back. Let's now go to invite teammates. So from here, of course, you can get your team on board. So if you have any teammates that is working with you on this project or working with you uh, managing Help Scout, just click here on add new user. Now you want to create a new user, just add them their first name and last name and also their email address. You can also select role. So it could, they could be an administrator, a user, or a light user. Next is which inbox they can access. So I'm just going to select my current inbox. And after that, just click on create user. So when you add or created a new user, they will now be added right here and be notified via their email. So when they click uh, the email invite, they can now open Help Scout and help you work right here. Let's go back. Next is add payment method. So to keep using all the features of your plus plan after your trial ends, you'll need to add a payment method. So now let's go to inbox. So from here, you'll see all of the inbox or the emails or the messages that you are receiving. So let's say you have already connected your Gmail account in Help Scout. So now you will see all of your inbox right here also. It will now be integrated right here. You can also go to chats. So they have a chat feature right here also. Assign, closed, and spam. So basically, this will be your new email. So you'll see all of your emails in one platform, which is the Help Scout. Next is docs. So you'll see all of your docs right here. You'll see all of the articles. So as you can see, this is the one that we have created a while ago. Next is messages. So from here, you can create your first messages. So these are automated messages that you can send to your contacts. Next is reports. So let's say all channels. So in here, we have we don't have any data yet. But if we already have data, you will see all of the reports right here. So you will see charts and graphs and all that stuff to monitor your uh, work. Next is customers. Of course, you can uh, see all of your customers right here. So if you have added users and customers, all of them will be shown right here. Next is manage. So you can manage your apps, your beacons, your companies, your properties. Basically, you'll see all of this here in manage. So basically, that's all the features of Help Scout. So just follow the setup guide and you'll be learning Help Scout in no time. So that's it. So if you find this video helpful, please hit like and subscribe. Thanks.